Hello, welcome back to another video. This one's gonna be a little bit different than my other ones. One, I'm wearing glasses. I don't really like need them every day, but my vision's been going south, just like my life. So, I'm gonna wear them. And two, I am going to be trying food today. I'm not like going anywhere or doing anything super exciting. But I'm going to be trying some Slovak candies, which I haven't tried yet. Most of you know, or should know, that I live in Slovakia. So, I have tried a lot of Slovak candy, food, whatever. So I made sure to choose some ones that I've avoided for some reason. Uh, some I haven't tried yet or haven't heard of. Um, so, expect some very bad reactions because I've been avoiding some of these for a reason because they're just weird. Let's get into it. I have a bag here and it's full of the food and I'm just gonna choose one randomly and then I'm gonna eat it. And I have a bottle of water and I have a smoothie. I'm really hoping this won't be terrible. We're starting this video off on a really good start. Banani. It's basically uh, chocolate covered pieces of banana. I know that chocolate and banana goes really good together, but I'm not sure how great it would be in a processed uh, candy bar. It looks like a piece of poop. Look at this. It looks like a peep on the inside. Okay. Um. That's surprisingly not terrible. It's like a banana runt with some chocolate. I'm very surprised. I'm very picky. I thought I wouldn't like this, but it's actually quite good. No, hey, I give it a 6 out of 10. Next one. The dreaded Picao. It's chocolate milk in a tube. It's very sweet. Um, a lot of people, you put it on things uh, or like in milk to make it chocolate milk. Like... It's really sweet chocolate. I don't know how it could be that bad. Okay. That just doesn't taste right. I'm going in for another one because I literally, I cannot describe that. It's just not, it's just not right. That's all I can quite say. No, I give that one like a 2 out of 10. That's just not good. Moving on. Three bit. This is a pretty popular one, I'm pretty sure. I've just never tried it. I've seen it in a lot of places. I'm really, I don't know what it is. But I know it's a chocolate bar. Oh, uh, I don't know any specifics. This is what it looks like on the inside. It doesn't look bad. Or maybe it's like the Slovak version of a Twix bar. Mm -hmm. It's basically the better version of a Twix bar. That's very good. That's a solid 9 out of 10. That's very good. Next on the list. Doxy Roxy. So these are like all hard candies and they have fruit flavors. I've never tried one before and I'm not gonna have a full one because hard candies take like 20 years to dissolve in your mouth. So this one. They all have like cute little designs on it of the fruit and stuff. So we'll see how it is. I don't know how you can get a hard candy wrong so I'm I'm not really worried so. Mm -hmm. It's quite good. It has a very strong flavor. It actually tastes a bit like a strawberry. This is good. Because most of the time, things like this don't actually taste like the real thing. So those, I give an 8 out of 10. I don't think I would eat them very, very often, but maybe if my breath smelled really bad and I just wanted to be a little bit fruity for the day. On to the next one. My counselor gave it to me. This is called Soya Veo Regi. Um, I saw this one in a video before. It just, uh, didn't get quite a good reaction. I'm, I'm a little bit nervous. <laughs> Here's how it looks. It's a little bit like, like, it smells like alcohol. Sorry. I don't know what alcohol smells like. <laughs> looks like kinetic sand. 
bottoms up. <clears throat> Excuse me. I just... People like that? I just don't understand. That was terrible. That was like eating sand with like some weird flavor that you can't quite put your finger on. Um, I give that a 1 out of 10. That just did not... That just... <clears throat> That grinded my gears. That did not soothe my taste buds at all. So, we're gonna go on to the next one. Coffee la latte. I'm pretty sure this is like a chocolate bar with some coffee flavoring in it. Which is good for me because I love coffee, so. It smells very coffee-like. That is already promising AF, so. I'm quite excited. Especially since it's a latte and that's like the best kind of coffee you can get. Let's, let's try this one. That is another good one. That also hits the spot. I very much like that. That's like two of my favorite things. Chocolate and coffee and in one. And um, it was very good. So I give that one a 9 out of 10 as well. I don't think it's a full 10 out of 10. Mm, could be a bit sweeter. It's a bit bitter. But um, in total, I enjoyed it. Let's go to the next one. Okay, I think I only have a few left, so that's good. That's a little bit less torture. Castani. I don't have any idea what this is. It's very good on the wrapper. I have high expectations, and I really hope this doesn't break my expectations. It looks like it's dark chocolate, which is okay. Dark chocolate here, not so bad. So we can only hope at this point. I think it's dark chocolate filled with milk chocolate. Cheers. That's exactly what it is. And it's really, really, really good. I definitely give this one a 10 out of 10. That is very good. It is like, tastes kind of like, I think it's a truffle. Um, I really enjoy that one. That is a 10 out of 10. That is our first 10 out of 10. That's good, but we're not done yet, so um, Hopefully we finish on a good note. I'm looking now. I have three left. <sighs> I have another Soyove Reggie, but this time it's with American forest fruit. <laughs> I'm just not excited. Like, look at that. <sighs> I just don't, I'm not down with that. Anyone who's watching this, pray for me. Thanks. Okay, here we go. No, no, absolutely not. You cannot try to cover up the crappy taste of this with some forest berries, okay? I'm not falling for it. It's still not good. No, one out of 10. No, 0.5 out of 10 for both of them. I'm deducting scores from both of them because that really hurt me. Next one. Cool. Kavenki. This is a waffer, and uh, people in Europe or Slovakia or everywhere in Europe, I don't know. But they're really good at waffers, so there's lots of waffer things here, but I've tried most of them. Sorry, I'm like really feisty now because of that. I'm gonna try to calm down. I'm gonna have some more of this um, coffee one, and maybe it'll get me back on track. Okay, we are back, and we're normal again. Waffers, very popular here. There's stuff like Haralki, but I'm not gonna do in this video because I've eaten like a thousand of these. So it's not even cool anymore. Because I'm pretty sick of them by now. Anyway, this is a new waffer, which I haven't, it's not new, but it's one I haven't tried yet. Here we go. It comes in like two bars, but I'm only gonna have half of one, half of the full thing. I'm not trying to get fatter than I am out here, okay? It's, it's good. It just has a little bit of a funky aftertaste and that's about, uh, that's about my only complaint. That was just, I don't know, four out of 10, four out of 10. It wasn't terrible, but it wasn't that good. It has like, that first initial bite, you're like, ooh, coffee. But then the next few bites, you're like, okay, <laughs> it slowly gets worse. This is the last one. It's a cocoa bar. I don't like coconuts at all. I've never liked them. 
Um, but I'm trying a bunch of things here which I have never tried. So I was like, okay, why not throw it in? Why not just put that in there and put a little more torture? We're doing it. Even though this is just bound to me, for me to hate it and take a bite out of it. Hopefully, um, it has better taste than my expectations. So. Um, I'm like not shocked by it. It just more or less has no taste rather than any. But the texture, the texture of the, the coconut like shavings is just, uh, not my thing. I give that a three out of 10 for texture. That one, uh. Anyways, that's some of the food. Um, there's a lot of other foods from Slovakia that are much more popular than these, but I've already tried them because I've been here for like five months. Stuff like that. So if you ever come to Slovakia and you like coconut chocolate, try that. Cocos thing. If you like milk in a tube, try Pikao. And if you like bananas and chocolate, try that too. Live your, live your life. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was uh, entertaining to watch me cringe so much for these foods I haven't had before. Thanks. Bye-bye.